All right, so now we're in week 23. We got a business trip. I think our dude came back from the business trip. Yeah, he's back in back in play. A merchant? I have 128. Let's go for the event. Uh, an employee found a strange unlabeled flask while cleaning and is about to drink it without even checking if it's poisonous. You recognize it as an evolution elixir plus one level. Excuse me. Will you let them drink it or will you take it for yourself? Plus 12 to master's power. Let him drink it. Level up, my dude. Right? Yep. Good on you. Let's go for an it. A veteran's adventure. Excuse me. Throat's making noise. I'm full of water. Well hydrated. Um, We can put the harpy in the back. She gives haste. So the monster's in the front, that's great, except you deal air damage. You're kind of weak against air. It's not that big of a weakness. So maybe that's okay. Fire damage, oh, 20%. You're dealing air damage as well. Fire and air to the front. <laughs> that sucks for you, sucks for you. They're weak against fire and nature, air and nature, ice and nature. So I feel like putting you in front. Air damage. You're strong against air. You're sort of strong against fire. You're better than anybody else right now. the weakness to to air uh to fire concerns me there also weakness to air and fire yeah that's uh that's a problem physical damage middle guy physical damage to the middle guy you're dealing fire to the front would love to take out the middle guy first but I don't think I'm going to be able to get that off. I'm going to put you there. We're going to try the Harpy. I don't think it's a good setup, but you know what? We got what we got. He's strong against fire, so that's kind of poopy. But if I can get him out, it'll prevent air damage. Oh, I think it's showing me some stuff here. I don't know what that is. I can't hover over it. Let's just deal some physical damage, I guess. He's weak against physical. Let's try to make that work to our advantage. All right. Same situation here. He's weak to fire, weak to air. Strong fire, weak to air. Weak to air, very badly. Who's doing air damage? You're doing air damage to the back. Fire to the front. Let's put you in front. Air to front. Fire to front. Air to back. Who goes in the back? Oh my god, everybody's weak against air. That's a problem. You're weak against fire. I hope to take out the middle guy before that becomes a problem. But I'm not sure that's going to play out the way I want it to. Physical or not physical, nature damage. We'll spare him this round. Um, enraging the next group is just gonna enrage the master. I don't know if we make it that far as well. Come get some. Let's try to make it work. Uh oh. Not off to a good start. Gust of wind applies haste to the monsters in front, applies tiredness three, damage dealt reduced by 30% for tiredness. That seems pretty good. Let's try to do that. That way he deals less damage. 
guy in the back isn't necessarily a, a concern. Can be affected by bleeding. That's what it was. I think I could have hovered over him and it would have gave me the stats. He's strong against nature? No, weak against nature. Um, But I think I need to go for these two. These front two are my concern. For the next set. Yeah, we're barely doing any damage. We're, I think we're in a bit of a trouble situation. They might make it to the um to the dungeon master. They might make it that far because they are absolutely wiping me out. Nothing I can do about it either. We just got to take it. Physical damage is not cutting it. What do we got here? That should kill him. I'm wondering if scaring him would have been a better option. I wonder if that's a better option. I'd rather take this guy out, if possible. First attack out the gate. Half my health bar. Get him out. Fire damage doesn't hurt. I don't care. Shake it off. That's a lot of damage. Look at that. That I like. Bubble protection. Love to see it. Am I going to take these guys out? Without losing anybody here. That would be amazing. Oh, it's happening. We did it. GG. Didn't even have to use this. Frostbite. That's an interesting trap. I'll take that. We haven't seen that before. Uh, deals 10 ice damage. Applies frostbite 2. Applies 1 additional stack if the target's ice resistance is negative. 5% of maximum life as ice damage per turn. Yeah, take that, please. Put it in my pocket. Uh, none of you really need a break. I mean, you're kinda in a bad way, but you're gonna have to hang in there, ma'am. Who can we upgrade? Who's worth upgrading here? Applies air weakness when attacking. 38 physical damage deals 100% of final damage to the hero position just behind the target. That 100% could actually be pretty damn good. Um, air damage and morale down. Um, adds one additional stack of poison, gains dodge and speed at the start of the fight. I'm going to give it to him. I can actually train him as well, but then we're broke. Is it worth it? Attack supply bleeding? Yeah, we'll go for it. We don't need no stinking money. Um, One of your traps didn't pass the last mandatory checkup. You can call a repair to come and look at your expense or send it for five weeks to the technical department who will fix it for free. If you have the appropriate artifact, you can, of course, repair it immediately. Um, sender, bud. I don't even use that. Catapult. Don't care. Siege. Uh, the company needs equipment. Ran out some traps. Um. I mean, we could rent something out, but I'd rather not. Uh, the R&D director has created a centrifuge that can transform hero blood into tears. Do you want to use it? Sure. 30 tears for 15 blood. Decent trade-off, I guess. Can't do the engineer. 
office tour. While walking through your corridors, you notice a monster waiting for a job interview. You can hire the candidate right now without intermediaries. On the other hand, what makes them think they can come in uninvited? <laughs> Intimidate. Skeleton Archer. Don't need them. Give me your tears. Champion. Week 29. Veterans, Veterans, Champion. We have a chance to get a rare thing. Master bonus. Master bonus rare thing. So either way, we're kind of, we're in what we're in, right? What's the difference between these? Disaster, resting room. Disaster, resting room. Um, you know what? Let's go for the champion fight. Could be a big mistake. Or not. I mean, there's no telling. I feel confident, I think. Depends on what level these monsters are. Or heroes are. Level 3. But it gives them a champion. We have a decent amount of... A decent amount of, um damage or levels right here I think well I mean three and two and I think the next set has two 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 yeah I mean it's not bad I mean depends on how this fight's gonna go right air damage to the front unit no weaknesses physical human uh, damage to the back he has ice weakness where's my ice guy Oh, is he in, uh, did I send him to do something somewhere? Rip him. He's dealing fire damage to the area. Uh-oh. Fire damage to the area. He's weak to ice and air. Who's dealing ice or air damage? I don't think anybody. She can go in the back. Physical damage. Oh, she's getting bopped. <laughs> she's getting bopped. Physical damage. He's doing air damage to the front. Are you weak to air? No, you're not weak to air. So that's decent. Are you weak to fire? You're weak to fire. That's a problem. You're also weak to fire. Dealing <sighs> fire area damage too. And that nature damage is not going to do anything to any of these guys. Physical damage to the back is the best we got, I think. Um. So in this case... Air to the front. He's strong against air. Let's put him in there. Fire damage is going to absolutely crush my people. So, let's do what we can with that. Physical damage. Ice damage. Applies frostbite 2. If the target's ice resistance is negative. So we have two with negative ice resistance. Would love to upgrade that thing. Uh, maybe we don't throw that there. I kind of feel like enraging the next group of monsters might help better. Of course, we do have this. But I'd rather whip the front guy or try to do something with him to scare him I don't know we'll cross that bridge when we get there he's doing air damage to the front physical to the back fire damage oh frick and it's air to the front so you have to go in the front physical to the back you're weak to physical you're strong to physical You're weak to air. So that's a little sketchy. Physical damage to the back, though. That's... Okay. This... Seems okay, I think. This also right here, I think, is the point where we freeze these guys out. If we can, I don't know. If the champion's the only one left... It's not really going to make a difference. 
Here we go. The ch challenge is on. Did he just swap my people? Randomly moves all targets. Or all monsters to another position at the start of your fight. Well, there's that. We're, we're off to a great start here. Would love to take that guy out. That randomness completely defeats the purpose of setting up my monsters, and I, I'm not a fan. Not a fan at all. We're barely love tapping the champion. Yeah, that's unfortunate. The guy in the back. I need to take him out. I mean, we are dealing a little bit of damage to both of these guys, which is great. Oh, don't kill me. Okay, we got we get another punch. It's not enough to take him out. One bopped both of my people. That sucks. Also, I think he'll die before he swaps my guys. Oh, the plays. The accidental plays. I kind of feel like scaring him is more beneficial, but I'm going to whip him. Get whipped. And in hope we uh, survive this fight. We didn't get mixed up this time. That's pretty good. We focus on the champion? Maybe not. Who's doing more damage? Air damage? Oh, that's a big hit there. Get burnt. Baton throw hits both of them. Boop, boop. Oh, he can't take it. Oh, that was a big hit. That's a good hit, too. We might be able to take out the champion. Ow. Kills the champion. Let's go ahead and do that. I feel confident that that was a, a good thing to do. Also, just got an achievement from that. Fantastic. We actually done it and survived. I mean, sort of, right? We didn't lose everybody. What are these options here? Oh my god. What are we looking at? Lure? Skeleton Lord? What is this, man? Unholy Shroud grants 50% to apply Frostbite with monsters' attacks, which deal morale. Damage, I guess. So that just gives 50% chance to apply ice damage that's kind of whack for an artifact uh lure minus five morale applies multi-action to the next regular trap i think i'd rather take this guy i have no idea what he is but he seems super strong he's got a star and he's a skeleton lord how do you pass him up air damage and ice damage too Attacks ricochet to the other heroes. Transforms into a random skeleton when the skeleton lord is defeated. Oh, <laughs> please <laughs> take that. <laughs> okay, we're hurting here a little bit. I need to get my people some assistance. Uh, You get removed. Who else? You also need to chill. Everybody else is okay. I kind of want to put this guy in front. Or room one, rather. Everything else, fire, nature. I mean, we got a decent spread of stuff here. It's a lot of physical damage in the front. We'll we'll work with this little setup here. Uh, trainer, I can upgrade somebody. Uh, well, not him. That would have been great. Doggo. Uh, what does he get? 
What is he gaining? Plus. Oh, maybe applies poison three rather than two, maybe. Siren applies weakness to air when attacking. We don't have a lot of air attackers though, so that's not really gonna help. I'll take that upgrade though. Seems good. Alchemist event. Let's go for the event. What do we got? Bloodthirsty coach. Oh, he's scary AF. Missing an eyeball. Some kind of ogre pretending to be a monster trainer offers you his services in exchange for some fresh blood. A succubus would help you lower the price plus level one. Oh, we don't have one to seduce him with. But 35 to level both of these up? Um, Doggo and Harpy? Let me see what that does. Did that actually level them up? Bruh, it did. So worth it. Let's go for the event. What do you have? Icarus. A wizard with a strange hat has fallen from the sky and landed in the entrance hall. He was carrying a magical artifact. Liquid nitrogen capsule. Ice damage from monster attacks are dealt to the target's fire resistance. If it's lower than ice resistance, I'll take that thing. Seems good. Veterans, adventurers, adventurers. That's ice. That's an ice cave. Frozen cave, stronghold. There's a disaster there. Reward trap, reward monster. That's interesting. But I think I'd rather go for the veterans. Uh, let's go for the stronger stuff here. Granted, I think the difficulty is just on normal. So is it really that difficult? I don't know. Who knows? Let's go. What are we looking at? Fire damage to the back. Dodge the, f the effects of the first trap. Morale loss is reduced by 50%. Gotcha. Passive. Can't be affected by poison. Fire damage to the front. There's a lot of fire damage happening here. 18 ice damage to the monster with the lowest ice resistance at the start of each fight. This is also a trap at the front. So... That deals ice damage. Only one person has negative ice damage. Or ice resistance. Only one has negative fire resistance. That's also just attack in the back. Physical damage? Okay. It's okay, I guess. But I'd rather... I think I'd rather... Rally the troops. Air to the front. Fire to the front and air to the front fire to the back <laughs> can't really put her in the back what i say air front fire front he's bad also bad to put in the front you can go in the front air front fire front you a strong mofo also deals air damage to the front ice damage to the back get in there boy Fire damage to the back. Who's got the most fire resistance? This guy, unfortunately. Um. So I think maybe we put... When the orc is attacked. You're doing air damage to the front. Put you in front. You in back. That's a yikes set up there. I'm not sure how, how I feel about that, but we got to do what we got to do. Circular saw, just chop them up. I know it's going to hurt you more, which is ideal. He can't be affected by poison. We only have three men here, so this is a sketchy setup. Air to the front. You're good front. You're bad back. Let's put you in the middle. Put you in the back. Come Fresh meat! Some. Come get some. Rage him out. Oh, I see it reduces their morale in the process, too. Which makes sense why he blocks it, because otherwise it would have hit him with something. Okay, that bite looks pretty good to the front guy. Oh no, the fire hurt so bad. 
Oh, that's a lot of damage to everybody. Middle guy, though. Who's doing more damage? Can't be affected by poison. Dodges the first attack. Morale gets reduced. I feel like that is a good one. Should probably do a little more focused fire. Uh oh. Haste? Oh no, don't zap him. Don't let him die so soon. He'll turn into a skeleton, so I mean, if he does die, that's a big if. We just need to hit him. Either way, he's dead. First guy's dead, you out. That's unfortunate. He didn't turn into a skeleton boy, so... Not sure what I was supposed to expect there. I think he was supposed to, wasn't he? Or maybe when he dies... Uh, he's forever a skeleton boy. Which is unfortunate. Unfortunate if that's the case, because we lost lost him already. Rip. Just had to do the challenge. Just had to do the challenge. Is it actually getting poisoned? Oh, you did. Poison dart. It's interesting. I'm seeing a lot more different traps now. I don't know if the game was updated or if um, it's just different. Ike we ice weakness. Ice resistance reduced by 40. Ah. That trap with the other trap? I don't know if one wears out before the other one would, would hit. Um, let's get you back in here. First of all, who who needs to break? You're, you're fine. You were supposed to turn into a thing. Back. Transforms into a random skeleton when the skeleton lord is defeated. Oh, if he's in the back. I understand now. Now it makes sense. Uh, first of all, you need to take a break. Nature damage. Uh, we need you in room one. You room two, please. Um, we can train somebody up. Level up. How much are you to level up? 400. What do you gain? More air damage? More fire resistance, more ice resistance, more nature resistance as well. Who's level one? You are. 250. Physical damage, air damage, tiredness three, area demoralized, nature damage gets increased, fire and physical damage get increased. I'm gonna, I'm gonna upgrade her. We'll see where that gets me. Black market, sell monsters in the garrison, doggo, nah, we don't want to sell the doggo. Wait, what? A banshee has offered her crying services for every for a very reasonable price. You can get a smaller quantity of tears for free if you show her a skeleton dog to get her all emotional. We have one. Cry it out, girl. Cry it out. Business trip. Choose an employee to protect the sales department during a business trip. Send three volunteers to plunder the place of your choice. Yeah, I don't know about that. We don't have too many to choose from. So, five weeks if I send you out there. Oh, you're in the the garrison anyway, so go for it. Siege. Company needs some equipment. Rent out some traps. Nope. Direct contribution. The doctor just had a brilliant idea. Why not cynically gather blood or tears directly from your employees? Motivation for all available monsters. 
Oh no. Don't lose motivation, my guys. Some of you might die. Refuse. What are the bosses gonna say? You're fired? <laughs> let's get let's get real. Champion in the frozen caves, let's go. This is it for all the marbles, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think anybody's made it to the to the dungeon master yet. I say that now and then I look at this guy like, okay, we're screwed. Flame shield. Reflects 35% of damage taken as fire damage. Yeah, that's level fours, huh? That's not a uh, it's not ideal. Negative fire damage though. Is that gonna reflect the damage though? That's weird. Ice. 50% minus 25. So, okay, ice weakness. Reduces resi redu resistances by 40%. He's at 50, so it's not even going to do anything to him. That's a problem. What happened to my ice guy? Now that I'm looking at it, did I sell him or something? Did, did I not have an ice guy? Did he just die somewhere along the way? I don't know what happened to him. We did have one, I thought. Maybe we didn't, I don't know. Rip him. Ice damage. Is anybody here dealing ice damage? Not really, so that's not, oh he is. Let's, let's do that and try to get that to do something. I want to put him in back. He's already got negative ice. That's kind of perfect for that situation. So let's see what we're looking at here. Um, ice damage to the front. Flame shield when the Archmage is attacked with fire. Deals 30 ice damage to all monsters when the Archmage kills a monster. So we need strong ice resistance here. You're going in the back. That's first and foremost. 28 nature da damage to the area. Applies poison to the high to the highest life. To the monster with the highest life at the start of, of the fight. Crap. Damage and morale taken from traps is reduced by 50%. Okay, that's not a big deal. As long as that ice resistance gets dropped. You're dealing air damage to the back. You have strong air resistance. So you definitely go there. Who's weak to nature? Okay, those two guys are. Fire damage? You're doing ice damage. 20% ice. 25% ice minus. Uh, Physical damage? Nature damage. Ice damage. You're dealing air damage to the back. So you can, you're kind of okay to put in the front, I think. So are you. Actually, you don't have ice resistance, so no. You have to go there. Uh, you're dealing physical damage. Monsters behind the skeleton take 15% less damage. That's pretty good. If I can protect him, I do like that. Also, damage dealt is reduced by 30%, potentially. You're dealing nature damage, though. She's strong against nature. You're doing air damage. She's also, okay, she's a little weak to air. Nobody's dealing fire damage to these guys, which is perfect. Monsters in front of the Harpy get uh, haste. I'd rather apply tiredness. Air resistance as well could be. She's just doing air damage and there's 50% air, 20% air, 35% air. It's not that good, but I'll, I'll try to fit her in there and see if we can see if we can get a win out of this. Um, so if we're doing that other thing that applies, um, Negative ice resistance. I think this might work with that as long as that effect doesn't get removed. 
but if it does, then we're kind of in trouble, I think. If you're dealing ice damage, that's minus 40% ice. Physical damage, fire damage to, to everybody. That concerns me with him. Everybody else, I'm not too concerned about. Physical damage hurts you. Air damage hurts you. Air is bad. Air attacks the back. So I'll put you maybe in the middle. You in the front. Who should go in the back? You're dealing air damage to the back, so not you. Okay, you back. Oh my, what attacks do you have? They're all fire, but I can attack the back with fire. So that's that works out, I think. I think that works out. Let's let's freaking go. Prepare to die. Reduced by 40. Let me see. I can't see. So he's got 10%. He's got 40. He's got 65. How long does that stay? I hope it stays forever. Because that's the only way we're going to get this tiredness. Perfect. Make him weak. Oh, wait. What? You reflected stuff? That did not feel good. Ice damage to the back guy, for sure. Whoa. One... One thing just killed me. That was unexpected. Let's burn the back guy before anything else happens that just decimates anybody here. I think we want to go for physical damage. Yeah, he's got like a... <laughs> Ice resistance. Okay, it's wearing off, I think. Three turns. That's a yikes. Um, Why is he fighting back? At the start of each fight. Like, I don't know why he keeps throwing daggers after I attack him. But that's going to hurt him pretty bad, I think. Yikes. Okay, don't don't count me out yet. Just hang in there, bud. Oh, I just died. <laughs> I don't know what happened. <laughs> I attacked him and I died. Is that the... I thought it only reflects damage if it's fire damage. But maybe, maybe I'm mistaken. I don't know. I don't know what just happened. I did that did not feel good at all. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay, I can actually crack the whip on that first guy. That looks good. He's got a lot of stuff affecting him. Here we go. You're the only one that had negative, I think. So that, yeah. So, I mean, it got stacked on him a little bit. That's okay. I'm okay with that. The champion is almost gone so far. We can bop him out right now. Seems like a good idea. Screw your champion. Also, now we can deal that fire damage and not worry about it reflecting back to us. Ouch. Oh, get hit, my dude. Get hit. We might actually do it without our guy even taking uh, freaking damage here. Where tag? appreciate the follow. Welcome to the stream. How you doing? If you stick around, we're doing this thing. Uh, Bean boozled for every new follow, every sub, or 10k channel points. Uh, we'll do that momentarily if you stick around if not no worries absolutely got the victory the board has decided to name you as company CEO congratulations thank you madam congratulations 
done. Bro, they didn't even make it to the freaking dungeon master. How good am I? <laughs> so good. Oh, you're not level five. The whole point was to get to level five. It's a passion. To unlock that person, but I guess we'll get it next time. <laughs>